Okay, so now that we have the pass from Dr. Cohen, let's uh, access the maintenance area. Man. You can hear I can hear dripping water. Can you guys hear that? It's like a cave, an ice cave down here. It's just a backdoor area. Rachni soldier. Oh man, it's a standing guard. Nothing that some polonium rounds in my, you know, could uh, couldn't take care of. Journal. Sneaking in, you've entered an unguarded back door into the sealed areas of her station. The guards are not alert to your presence. To the hot labs. Okay. More stuff here to hack. Got that. More stuff. <laughs> more stuff. Just got more stuff. Alright, well that's where we need to go. We'll do that. Let's go check this area. Oh, an upgrade kit. And technician kit. That's probably where the elevator with the where the guards are. Okay, let's go into the lab here, and we will now... Oh, and look who is here waiting for us. Alright, now I'm going to save here because I've actually found out that historically, this boss battle can have a, a, a few bugs, a few game-breaking bugs. Uh, or <laughs> So, I'm going to save here just before this uh, boss battle, and uh, hopefully everything will go fine. So, But just in case it doesn't, there we go. Now we have manually saved. Hello, Matriarch You Venezia. do not know the privilege of being a mother. There is power in creation. To shape a life, turn it toward happiness or despair. Hmm. Her children were to be ours, raised to hunt and slay Saren's enemies. I won't be moved by sympathy, no matter who you bring into this confrontation. That's not why Liara is here. Liara's here because she wants to be, not because I asked her to. Indeed. What have you told him about me, Liara? What could I say, Mother? That you're insane? Evil? Should I explain how to kill you? What could I say? Have you Poor faced Liara. an Asari commando unit before? Few humans have. What about Liara? Are you going to kill her, your own daughter? I can't believe you'd kill your own daughter. I now realize I should have been stricter with her. Really? Uh-oh. Apparently she put me in stasis. Oh, she's got some commandos with her. Nice. Please. I'll take care of them. See? Nothing to it. Nezia's power level. It's over 9,000! <laughs> I couldn't resist. I couldn't resist. I had to go there. Ah, oh, now she's got some geth as I'm flopping around. <laughs> some of the there. Oh my gosh, I'm up in the air. <laughs> Whoa! Oh no. Oh no. Please don't tell me. Oh no. Oh, phew. See what I mean? There are times where all of a sudden you'll get frozen in place. Got that, Geth. She, her power level is lowering. She summons more Geth. She's getting weaker. Again, woman. You could have worn a different dress. See what I mean? It's like my Shepard just keeps going bouncing up, up and down. What? Oh no, 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 oh no, don't, no, no. Oh my gosh, I almost got stuck on the stairs. Oh, phew. Okay, so it's auto saving. Oh, good. <laughs> Looks like I, I, I beat it. Oh my gosh, see what I mean? It's very easy to get stuck and, you know, for it to be glitchy. Oh man. This is not over. Saren is unstoppable. My mind is filled with his light. Everything is clear. The Rachni seem to disagree. The Rachni didn't cooperate with you. Why should I? 
I will not betray him. You will. You... You must listen. What? Saren still whispers in my mind. I can fight his compulsions briefly, but the indoctrination is strong. Indoctrination? Wait a minute. Why should I? Why should I believe you? Why are you able to break free of his control now? Yeah. I sealed a part of my mind away from the indoctrination. You can do that. Saving it for a moment when I could help destroy him. It will not last long. Oh, I didn't know. Apparently, you could do that. Apparently. So you could lose control and attack us again? So you could turn on me again? Yes, but it would not be my will, Shepard. So she's been under his control. People are not themselves around Saren. You come to idolize him, worship him. You would do anything for him. The key is Sovereign, his flagship. It is a dreadnought of incredible size, and its power is extraordinary. She means the ship that I saw back on Eden Prime. Yeah, it attacked Eden Prime. That giant ship we saw that fl that flew away? Where did he get that ship? Sovereign's not like other ships. Where did it come from? I cannot say. The Geth did not build it. Its technology is far more advanced than that of any known species. The longer you stay aboard, my gosh, woman. the Was more that dress Saren's really necessary? will seems correct. <laughs> you sit at his you feet worn and something smile a more as his words that. pour into you. Ugh. It is subtle at first. I thought I was strong enough to resist. Instead, I became a willing tool, eager to serve. He sent me here to find the location of the Mew Relay. The Mew Relay? Its position was lost thousands of years ago. So apparently, Saren's been controlling her through indoctrination. Huh. Yeah, how do you lose a giant thing like a relay? How does something that big go missing? 4,000 years ago, a star nearby went supernova. Okay. The shockwave propelled the relay out of its system, oh. but did not damage it. Huh. Its precise vector and speed are impossible to determine. As millennia passed, the nebula created by the nova enveloped the relay. It is difficult to find any cold object in interstellar space, particularly something swathed in hot dust and radiation. And that's what you're here for? Someone on Novaria found it? Two thousand years ago, the Rachni inhabited that region of our galaxy. They discovered the relay. The Rachni can share memories across generations. Queens inherit the knowledge of their mothers. Wow. I took the location of the relay from the Queen's mind. I was not gentle. The Rachni found the relay? How did the Rachni find it? They searched, patiently. They are territorial creatures, driven to close any possible way into their systems. And what is Saren's plan? Why does Saren need the Mew Relay? He believes it will lead him to the Conduit. I would tell you more if I could, but Saren did not share his counsel with me. I was merely a servant to his cause. You regret your actions. You can still make it right. Give me the information. I was not myself, but I should have been stronger. I transcribed the data to an OSD. Take it, please. Knowing the relay's coordinates is not enough. Do you know where he planned to go from there? Saren wouldn't tell me his destination. But you must find out quickly. I transmitted the coordinates to him before you arrived. Oh, great. So he knows you too. You have to stop me. I, oh, I can't. She's losing control. His teeth are at my ear. Fingers on my spine. You, sh you should. Great. She's about to turn oh, on us again. You should. Mother, I don't leave. Fight him. I'm sorry, Liara. You've always made me proud, Liara. Aww. I'm so sorry, Liara. Die. Oh, man. I'm so sorry, Liara. I cannot go on. You will have to stop him, Shepard. No, stay with us. Maybe we can help you. Hold on. We've got Medigel. Maybe we can... No. 
He is still in my mind. I am not entirely myself. I never will be again. Mother. Good night, little wing. I will see you again with the dawn. Aww. I'm sorry, the Liara. Light. They always said there would be a... A light at the end of the tunnel? <sighs> She's gone. Goodbye, Benezia. At least we now know she wasn't doing this at, for, at her own will. I'm so sorry, Liara. And we still have this Rachni Queen to deal with. Uh, I just feel so bad for Liara. She just had to watch her mom die. But at least she got to know that it wasn't her mom's... Uh, that she wasn't evil. That it wasn't her fault. That Saren was controlling her the whole time. <laughs>